Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Donkey Teeth here, and uh, as you can see, this is the new 1.34 GTA Online update, and this is the CEO update. And me and my buddies have worked hard with my friend, who's the CEO. We've been his associates, and as you can see in the warehouse, we've got quite a bit of uh, crates, and we actually have a little over a million dollars worth of uh, crates. And he just started up the sale mission. And I'm going to tell you why you should never be an associate. Uh, when, when you become an associate, you get to help out the CEO on the mission, and the CEO never gets paid during the missions. He has to spend money to actually buy, actually find the loot crates. He only gets paid in, when he turns in to sell, when he turns in to sell the crate. The associates they get paid once every two months, depending on how long. that we would actually get some of the cut from doing this uh, sell crate because it was a million dollars and we all worked together on it we all stayed in the whole time while we got all the crates so we thought we would get a little bit of a cut but as you see we don't get any money the only money that associates get paid is the money that they make every 15 minutes so the associates do not get paid near enough money as you see here we have uh, your vehicle are you worried something will happen to it don't let fear prevent you from getting the most out of life take out full coverage insurance with morse mutual and we'll replace your vehicle after one quick call morse mutual insurance is sold at all participating garages so yeah as of right now the, it is not worth it to be an associate it, it's, it's worth it to be a ceo if you have a lot of money buy good warehouses, but other than that, I would not recommend being an associate because you do not get paid well at all. Uh, thanks for watching, it's been Donkey Teeth, if you like this video and want